Have you ever gone hiking in the mountains? Yes. I love hiking in the mountains. The breathtaking views are worth the effort. Have you ever gone hiking in the mountains? Yes. I love hiking in the mountains. The breathtaking views are worth the effort. What's your favorite mountain range to visit? The Rockies are my favorite. There's a sense of serenity when surrounded by those majestic peaks. What's your favorite mountain range to visit? The Rockies are my favorite. There's a sense of serenity when surrounded by those majestic peaks. Are you more into winter or summer activities in the mountains? I prefer winter activities like skiing. The snow-covered landscapes create a magical atmosphere. Are you more into winter or summer activities in the mountains? I prefer winter activities like skiing. The snow-covered landscapes create a magical atmosphere. Do you have a specific mountain trail that you find particularly challenging and rewarding? The Appalachian Trail is both challenging and rewarding. Completing sections gives a great sense of accomplishment. Do you have a specific mountain trail that you find particularly challenging and rewarding? The Appalachian Trail is both challenging and rewarding. Completing sections gives a great sense of accomplishment. Have you ever camped overnight in the mountains? Camping in the mountains is one of my favorite experiences. The starry night sky is unforgettable. Have you ever camped overnight in the mountains? Camping in the mountains is one of my favorite experiences. The starry night sky is unforgettable. What wildlife encounters have you had while exploring the mountains? I once saw a bear from a safe distance while hiking in the Smoky Mountains. It was both thrilling and awe-inspiring. What wildlife encounters have you had while exploring the mountains? I once saw a bear from a safe distance while hiking in the Smoky Mountains. It was both thrilling and awe-inspiring. How do you prepare for a trip to the mountains, considering the weather and terrain? Checking weather forecasts and packing essentials like layers and sturdy boots is crucial for a mountain trip. How do you prepare for a trip to the mountains, considering the weather and terrain? Checking weather forecasts and packing essentials like layers and sturdy boots is crucial for a mountain trip. Is there a specific mountain town you enjoy visiting for its charm and atmosphere? I love visiting Aspen. The combination of scenic beauty and vibrant town life is unmatched. Is there a specific mountain town you enjoy visiting for its charm and atmosphere? I love visiting Aspen. The combination of scenic beauty and vibrant town life is unmatched. Are there any mountain activities you haven't tried yet but want to? I've never tried rock climbing in the mountains, but it's on my adventure bucket list. Are there any mountain activities you haven't tried yet but want to? I've never tried rock climbing in the mountains, but it's on my adventure bucket list. What's your favorite season to witness the changing colors of the mountains? Autumn is my favorite. The vibrant hues of red and gold transform the mountains into a living canvas. 
What's your favorite season to witness the changing colors of the mountains? Autumn is my favorite. The vibrant hues of red and gold transform the mountains into a living canvas. Do you prefer a solo mountain adventure or going with a group of friends? I enjoy both, but there's a unique tranquility in solo hikes where you can immerse yourself in nature. Do you prefer a solo mountain adventure or going with a group of friends? I enjoy both. But there's a unique tranquility in solo hikes where you can immerse yourself in nature. Have you ever experienced altitude sickness while in the mountains? Fortunately, I haven't experienced altitude sickness. Staying hydrated and acclimatizing properly is key. Have you ever experienced altitude sickness while in the mountains? Fortunately, I haven't experienced altitude sickness. Staying hydrated and acclimatizing properly is key. What's your go to mountain snack or energy boost during a hike? Trail mix with nuts and dried fruits keeps me energized during mountain hikes. What's your go to mountain snack or energy boost during a hike? Trail mix with nuts and dried fruits keeps me energized during mountain hikes. How do you capture the beauty of the mountains photography or simply enjoying the moment? I love capturing the beauty through photography but also make sure to take moments to simply soak it all in. How do you capture the beauty of the mountains photography or simply enjoying the moment? I love capturing the beauty through photography but also make sure to take moments to simply soak it all in. Have you ever participated in a mountain marathon or any organized mountain event? I haven't done a mountain marathon yet, but it's something I'm considering for the challenge. Have you ever participated in a mountain marathon or any organized mountain event? I haven't done a mountain marathon yet, but it's something I'm considering for the challenge. What's your most memorable sunrise or sunset experience in the mountains? Witnessing the sunrise from the summit of Mount Haleakala in Hawaii was absolutely breathtaking. What's your most memorable sunrise or sunset experience in the mountains? Witnessing the sunrise from the summit of Mount Haleakala in Hawaii was absolutely breathtaking. Are there any mountain traditions or rituals you follow during your trips? I always take a moment to appreciate the sunrise and express gratitude for the opportunity to be in the mountains. Are there any mountain traditions or rituals you follow during your trips? I always take a moment to appreciate the sunrise and express gratitude for the opportunity to be in the mountains. How do you navigate through the mountains using maps, GPS, or a combination of both? I prefer a combination of maps and GPS to ensure I stay on the right trail, especially in unfamiliar terrain. How do you navigate through the mountains using maps, GPS, or a combination of both? I prefer a combination of maps and GPS to ensure I stay on the right trail, especially in unfamiliar terrain. Have you ever done stargazing in the mountains, away from city lights? 
Stargazing in the mountains is a mesmerizing experience the clarity of the night sky is unmatched. Have you ever done stargazing in the mountains, away from city lights? Stargazing in the mountains is a mesmerizing experience the clarity of the night sky is unmatched. What's your preferred type of accommodation when staying in the mountains camping, cabins, or lodges? I enjoy the rustic charm of cabins they offer comfort while still being close to nature. What's your preferred type of accommodation when staying in the mountains camping, cabins, or lodges? I enjoy the rustic charm of cabins they offer comfort while still being close to nature. Are there any specific mountain peaks you dream of conquering one day? Dreaming of conquering Everest the challenge and the symbolism of reaching the world's highest peak are enticing. Are there any specific mountain peaks you dream of conquering one day? Dreaming of conquering Everest the challenge and the symbolism of reaching the world's highest peak are enticing. How do you stay environmentally conscious when exploring the mountains? I practice leave no trace principles. Ensuring I leave the mountains as pristine as I found them. How do you stay environmentally conscious when exploring the mountains? I practice leave no trace principles. Ensuring I leave the mountains as pristine as I found them. What's the most unexpected thing you've encountered during a mountain expedition? I once encountered a herd of mountain goats unexpectedly, and it added a delightful surprise to the hike. What's the most unexpected thing you've encountered during a mountain expedition? I once encountered a herd of mountain goats unexpectedly, and it added a delightful surprise to the hike. Is there a mountain folklore or legend that you find intriguing? The legends surrounding the Himalayas, especially about the Yeti, are fascinating to me. Is there a mountain folklore or legend that you find intriguing? The legends surrounding the Himalayas, especially about the Yeti, are fascinating to me. Have you ever tried mountain biking on challenging trails? Mountain biking down steep trails provides an adrenaline rush, and it's a thrilling way to experience the mountains. Have you ever tried mountain biking on challenging trails? Mountain biking down steep trails provides an adrenaline rush, and it's a thrilling way to experience the mountains. Do you have a favorite national park in the mountains that you frequently visit? Yosemite National Park holds a special place in my heart. The iconic landscapes are awe-inspiring. Do you have a favorite national park in the mountains that you frequently visit? Yosemite National Park holds a special place in my heart. The iconic landscapes are awe-inspiring. What's your preferred type of mountain climate temperate, alpine, or subarctic? I enjoy the alpine climate. The crisp air and snow-capped peaks create a picturesque setting. What's your preferred type of mountain climate temperate, alpine, or subarctic? I enjoy the alpine climate the crisp air and snow-capped peaks create a picturesque setting. How do you stay physically fit to tackle the challenges of mountain adventures? 
Regular cardio and strength training keep me physically fit and prepared for the demands of mountain hikes. How do you stay physically fit to tackle the challenges of mountain adventures? Regular cardio and strength training keep me physically fit and prepared for the demands of mountain hikes. Are there any mountain festivals or events you've attended and enjoyed? The Telluride Mountain Film Festival was a memorable experience, celebrating mountain culture through films and discussions. Are there any mountain festivals or events you've attended and enjoyed? The Telluride Mountain Film Festival was a memorable experience, celebrating mountain culture through films and discussions. How do you overcome moments of fatigue or exhaustion during a long mountain trek? Taking short breaks, staying hydrated, and focusing on the scenery help me overcome fatigue during mountain treks. How do you overcome moments of fatigue or exhaustion during a long mountain trek? Taking short breaks, staying hydrated, and focusing on the scenery help me overcome fatigue during mountain treks. Do you have a favorite mountain-related quote or saying that resonates with you? Climb the mountains and get their good tidings. Nature's peace will flow into you as sunshine flows into trees. John Do you have a favorite mountain-related quote or saying that resonates with you? Climb the mountains and get their good tidings. Nature's peace will flow into you as sunshine flows into trees. John Muir What's your opinion on the balance between adventure and safety in mountain activities? Adventure is important, but safety always comes first. Proper preparation and knowledge are crucial for a successful mountain trip. What's your opinion on the balance between adventure and safety in mountain activities? Adventure is important, but safety always comes first. Proper preparation and knowledge are crucial for a successful mountain trip. Are there any mountain conservation efforts or organizations you actively support? I support the Sierra Club and their efforts to preserve and protect mountain environments. Are there any mountain conservation efforts or organizations you actively support? I support the Sierra Club and their efforts to preserve and protect mountain environments. How do you choose your mountain destinations based on scenery? difficulty, or a combination? I consider a combination of factors scenery, difficulty, and the overall experience when choosing mountain destinations. How do you choose your mountain destinations based on scenery, difficulty, or a combination? I consider a combination of factors scenery, difficulty, and the overall experience when choosing mountain destinations. What's the longest continuous time you've spent in the mountains, and how did it impact you? Spending a week in the Rocky Mountains allowed me to connect with nature on a deeper level and appreciate its grandeur. What's the longest continuous time you've spent in the mountains, and how did it impact you? Spending a week in the Rocky Mountains allowed me to connect with nature on a deeper level and appreciate its grandeur. How do you deal with unexpected weather changes during a mountain excursion? 
Being prepared with proper gear and clothing helps me adapt to unexpected weather changes in the mountains. How do you deal with unexpected weather changes during a mountain excursion? Being prepared with proper gear and clothing helps me adapt to unexpected weather changes in the mountains. Have you ever explored underground caves or caverns within mountainous regions? Exploring caves in the Appalachian Mountains provided a unique and somewhat surreal adventure. Have you ever explored underground caves or caverns within mountainous regions? Exploring caves in the Appalachian Mountains provided a unique and somewhat surreal adventure. Is there a specific mountain cuisine or food you enjoy indulging in during your trips? I love trying local mountain cuisine, and in the Alps, fondue is a must-try for me. Is there a specific mountain cuisine or food you enjoy indulging in during your trips? I love trying local mountain cuisine, and in the Alps, Fondue is a must-try for me. How do you maintain a connection with nature and the mountains in your everyday life? Regular hikes and nature walks, even in local parks, help me maintain a connection with the natural world. How do you maintain a connection with nature and the mountains in your everyday life? Regular hikes and nature walks, even in local parks, help me maintain a connection with the natural world. Have you ever faced any unexpected challenges or obstacles during a mountain journey? Getting caught in a sudden snowstorm was unexpected, but it taught me the importance of being flexible and adapting to nature's surprises. Have you ever faced any unexpected challenges or obstacles during a mountain journey? Getting caught in a sudden snowstorm was unexpected, but it taught me the importance of being flexible and adapting to nature's surprises. Do you have a favorite mountain-themed book or movie that inspires your adventures? Into the Wild by John Krakauer has been a source of inspiration, making me appreciate the raw beauty of the wilderness. Do you have a favorite mountain-themed book or movie that inspires your adventures? Into the Wild by John Krakauer has been a source of inspiration, making me appreciate the raw beauty of the wilderness. How do you approach meeting fellow mountain enthusiasts during your trips? I'm always open to striking up conversations with fellow hikers, sharing experiences, and gaining new insights into different mountain trails. How do you approach meeting fellow mountain enthusiasts during your trips? I'm always open to striking up conversations with fellow hikers, sharing experiences, and gaining new insights into different mountain trails. Are there any specific mountain activities that you find meditative or spiritually uplifting? Meditation at mountain summits brings a sense of tranquility and connection to something larger than ourselves. Are there any specific mountain activities that you find meditative or spiritually uplifting? Meditation at mountain summits brings a sense of tranquility and connection to something larger than ourselves. How do you mentally prepare for the challenges and solitude that come with mountain exploration? Mental preparation involves setting realistic expectations, 
practicing mindfulness, and embracing the solitude as a form of self-discovery. How do you mentally prepare for the challenges and solitude that come with mountain exploration? Mental preparation involves setting realistic expectations, practicing mindfulness, and embracing the solitude as a form of self-discovery. Have you ever explored mountainous regions outside of the United States? Yes. I've explored the Swiss Alps, and the cultural and natural diversity added a unique flavor to the mountain experience. Have you ever explored mountainous regions outside of the United States? Yes, I've explored the Swiss Alps, and the cultural and natural diversity added a unique flavor to the mountain experience. What's your opinion on the impact of tourism on mountain ecosystems, and how can it be mitigated? Responsible tourism is crucial minimizing environmental impact, respecting local cultures, and promoting conservation efforts can help mitigate negative effects. What's your opinion on the impact of tourism on mountain ecosystems? And how can it be mitigated? Responsible tourism is crucial minimizing environmental impact, respecting local cultures, and promoting conservation efforts can help mitigate negative effects. How do you navigate through the challenge of acclimatizing to higher altitudes? Gradual ascent and proper hydration are key components of acclimatization to higher altitudes during mountain treks. How do you navigate through the challenge of acclimatizing to higher altitudes? Gradual ascent and proper hydration are key components of acclimatization to higher altitudes during mountain treks. Are there any mountain traditions or rituals from different cultures that you find fascinating? The Sherpa traditions in the Himalayas, including prayer flag ceremonies, are deeply rooted in the cultural fabric of the mountains. Are there any mountain traditions or rituals from different cultures that you find fascinating? The Sherpa traditions in the Himalayas, including prayer flag ceremonies, are deeply rooted in the cultural fabric of the mountains. How do you introduce friends or newcomers to the joys of mountain exploration? I start with easier trails and emphasize the beauty of the experience, hoping to instill a love for mountain exploration in them. How do you introduce friends or newcomers to the joys of mountain exploration? I start with easier trails and emphasize the beauty of the experience, hoping to instill a love for mountain exploration in them. Have you ever participated in mountain conservation projects or cleanup initiatives? Yes. I've volunteered for trail maintenance and cleanup projects to give back to the mountains and preserve their beauty for future generations. Have you ever participated in mountain conservation projects or cleanup initiatives? Yes. I've volunteered for trail maintenance and cleanup projects to give back to the mountains and preserve their beauty for future generations.